Hey there folks, Peter here with BlackRock Business and today on our channel I am going to show you how you can pair the little EMV chip reader with your phone or tablet mobile device. Uh, we're doing Android today. I'm going to show you that, how to uh, do it on Android. I actually have it up on my screen here as you can see, uh, mirrored. So I got my little phone down here and I'm going to show you exactly how you can pair the go payment emv chip card reader this also works in quickbooks online on your phone i might have might add uh, these are free if you get the go payment app right inside you can get one of these for free and it works very simply you just stick the card in actually that's the swiper sorry you just stick the card in like that and that is how you take a credit card uh, you can do this inside the go payment app but I am going to tell you, uh, I think it's a little easier on Android when you just go right to the Bluetooth. So I held down on my Bluetooth icon there. And I've got all sorts of other Bluetooth <laughs> devices in here. Now, this is super simple. There's a little tiny button. I don't know if that's going to focus or not, but there's a little tiny button right on here. I'm just going to hold that down for about a second. And I see the green light come on on the top of my reader. And then on my phone at the top here, I'm going to hit scan. I'm going to scroll all the way down to the bottom. And we can see that there's a couple different devices here. Uh, for some reason, there are two devices that are this one. We can see they're the same exact identification. So I'm just going to click on the one that kind of looks like a phone. It's, I'm looking at these CHB ones here. So I'm going to click the one in the middle. It's going to go into pairing. It's saying, hey, there's a pairing request, and I'm going to hit OK. So it's pairing. It's then going to show up in my list of paired devices. And once that happens, then I should be good to go. If I head to my Go payment, excuse me, this is going to take one second. Oop, go payment. Now in Go payment or QuickBooks Online, once I head in there, I can go to the plus button, new sale, let's say one penny, review order, charge, card reader, and it should find my card reader right away because I just paired it. There it is. We can see it at the top. We can see the battery life, and we're all set to go. Uh, if you are not paired to your reader in the Go Payment app here, it'll say it's trying to find it. And I don't know, sometimes it's kind of finicky and doesn't work very well. I think doing it on the on the Bluetooth menu there is is a lot easier to pair it there. So my name's Peter with BlackRock Business. This was a quick run through on pairing your card reader to your mobile device on Android. I hope you have yourself an excellent day. Thanks. Bye.